Good morning. Good morning. It's Morning Devos with Pastor Jen. And this morning I have a special guest. This is Julia. Hi. And she is one of the interns at Camp Promise. And September is Camp Promise Month here at the Berry for Methodist Church. And we're so excited to share a little bit about the story behind Camp Promise and who is working with this very special program. And so Julia is with me. So tell me a little bit about yourself and how you came to be a part of the Camp Promise family. Uh, that is a very good question. Um, I come from Germany and um, a few months ago I received my first university degree and I want to become a primary school teacher and my subject, subjects are German, math and English. Wow. And um, everyone who studies English has to go abroad for a time um, to practice especially talking right. so that English teachers sound as natural as possible. And um, there is no, um, it's free what we do. And um, I wanted to give God this time and uh, started to pray where I could go uh, and what I what I should do, right? And um, I had different plans. My church is very uh, connected with uh, churches in uh, the United States, and um, they know they've got good relations with people from LA, South Carolina, and um, I wanted to go there. And um, everything I planned, all the connections, it never worked out. And I was so disappointed. And I'm a person, I really want to plan everything. I'm not, not uh, very spontaneous. Okay. And um, so I prayed and prayed and I waited for a very long time. And um, I know um, the time that I graduated came closer and closer and I got so nervous. And I always said, God, I need you. I need to find my place. And I didn't find it. And um, so I came up with plan Z, uh, which, was a, which was an au pair program in England. And I didn't want to go there. Mm. But I thought, if I find nothing, I will go because I have to. And um, I thought I will apply. And then I'll see if this is my open door or my place, even though I didn't want it to go there and I called and was so desperate and they told me um, that someone already got the job um, and I was I was relieved but on the other hand I was like that's also not good I have to find something and then I asked mm -hmm. um, on the phone if they knew a similar program and um, then they told me about impact and the lead cell mission and it sounded so great and I looked it up and then I found Camp Promise and um, the moment I, um, I opened up the website my heart started to beat and it was, it was really crazy. I saw um, pictures of the children and yeah, everything um, that, we, that the camp does um, telling them about Jesus and, and I, I started to cry because I was so touched and I feel like this will be my place and um, yeah I didn't know if it was my place but then every door was opened mm -hmm. and I've got so much peace so much joy and I um, can see now that God leads me I pray and then he always directs me mm -hmm. he opens doors he, he closes even more doors and um, I'm really too happy uh, happy to be here I, I love how Julia said, I just wanted to give this time to the Lord. And so she prayed about it. And then because her heart's desire was to do what God wanted her to do, literally just in prayer and obedience, God opened doors, God shut doors, but it really comes down to what the desire of our heart is. Yeah, that's true. And I just, I love hearing this story. So what are you excited about? I'm excited about, about a lot of things. And um, I was really excited about um, about very good donuts. Um, I heard that you are uh, very uh, famous for it. I, w I was looking for um, really good pancakes and maple syrup. Yes. Which I love, by the way. Oh, good. Um, the food here is very good. We were told that we will gain a lot of weight, which is okay. <laughs> and um, yeah, I'm excited about um, building God's kingdom. I'm excited about um, praying for children and with children and telling them about the gospel because um, I experienced 
God in my life, in my daily life, but also in hard times. And um, there were so many situations where he healed my heart, where I was so broken and God did amazing things out of it. And this is the reason why I, I really need to share because he is good. And yeah, I cannot keep this for myself. And so I'm excited to share everything, to have a lot of fun. Um, yeah, at camp with our team and the kids. And yeah. Wow, I'm excited. So how can we pray for you? Um, um, it would be great if, when you pray for us. We need prayer. Um, it would be great if you could pray that God's Spirit needs us. Um, because we don't know what the kids need. Sometimes they have a bad day and they come, they, they have very bad circumstances and it would be great that you pray for us that we um, have the right work in the right situation mm -hmm. and that when we prepare program and especially our word up that God will talk to us um, I want to see children children getting touched by God and by his love by um, getting transformed and healed yeah. in different ways that um, we can build his kingdom okay well, you heard it, so let's pray. You yes. ready? All right, let's pray. So, dear Lord Jesus, thank you so much for Julia and her openness just to serve you this year. So we do ask that you would guide and direct her, that our spirit would continue just to be sensitive to your leading. And Lord God, that you would build your kingdom through Julia and Camp Promise, that your spirit would lead them, that they would have wonderful opportunities to share with the children and to be able to minister to the children exactly in whatever they are feeling in that moment. And so Father, we ask that you bless Julia and encourage her and bless the ministry of Camp Promise. We ask this in your mighty name, amen. Amen. Well, thank you so much for joining me this morning. Yeah, thank you so much for the invitation. I'm excited. I'm excited for what God's going to do uh, through the ministry of Camp Promise and Julia. And so remember too, with this good news, maybe you know of someone that might like to get involved or you might like to give. So we encourage you to go to the website www.camppromiseberry.org www.camppromiseberry.org if you have any questions uh, if you attend BFMC you can reach out to Allison one of the area directors here on Sunday morning she would love to chat with you and so with this good news remember to like share go outside even if it might be a bit cool and help your community experience Christ bye bye